blind dating six women what is based your on I their bodies. Or skip it. Is another is another uh Freedom Friday, baby. Let's do it. And this time we're freeing the nipple. All right, let's do it. Blind dating six women before we get to uh, Mass Chip season five, by the way, because we are going to do that. Ideal body type. I would say someone who's like fit, someone who could definitely just like throw me around. Yeah. Oh, all right. <laughs> That's a good turn. That's a good turn. <laughs> Noted. I love this new Jubilee. New Jubilee has like decided that you know we're we're going crazy we're going crazy with it we're going horny okay this is jubilee after dark and i love it personally okay it's my demon name is Makai. time it's horny I'm time 23 years old i'm from los angeles california and i do social media marketing i would say my body type is someone that's very slim um someone that keeps up with themselves I, I wouldn't say tall, but just someone around my around my height. As long as she's not like three or four feet taller than me. Okay. I'll tell you. Yeah. Oh wait, sorry. <laughs> wait, itches. Sorry, I'm in itches. I'm in itches. I'm in itches. I'm not the the biggest or the strongest, but I know that I have some great qualities. So I, I like my body. I'm always gonna be confident about myself. Interesting toes. <laughs> Very interesting toes. Wow, fat phobic and ableist. Yeah, get. Yes, he is. I'm gonna say there are some people that do keep up with their toes. <laughs> There's also some women who I feel like my toes look a little bit better than. Oh, oh wow. the shade. Wow. The shade. <laughs> what is your ideal body type? So someone that's fit, not really that they have to be like really strong and very like, I guess muscular, but more that they like have a confidence about themselves. Really the personality like really makes or breaks if I like them or not. And that they like the- This is like, you could tell a person's weight from their ankles, by the way. I'm just saying. Like, not that, I mean, he is probably ultimately going to make a decision based on that as well. Do not misunderstand me. But let's be real, because the entire purpose of this fucking game is to literally look at like, you know, the entire purpose of this specific one is to just, you know, it's, it's shallow in nature. So don't, do not look at a situation like this and be like, I can't believe that they are not talking about, uh, I cannot believe that they're not talking about the personality. It's like, this is literally just that. The outdoors and being active. Cause if they can't do- Short fit girls can have cankles. Yeah. Active stuff with me. It's really hard for me to want to like connect with them. Okay. Tall, fit. <laughs> um, uh, but not too big because I'm I'm kind of a small person, so not like you can kill me. There's ankles. Um, like they're kidnapping you. Yeah. You don't need to be a gym rat or look like Chris Evans, although he's pretty fine and Captain America's ass could like, you know, I'd be down with it. But you don't need to look like that for me to be like into you. Oh my gosh, you got a toe ring. I do prefer somebody who's taller than me. The the most I'll go shorter than me is like two inches. Um, I'm sorry, babe, not two feet, but two inches. <laughs> I feel like Hassan would understand my eating disorder and BDD issues. Like how do you pick up on all these little things? Cause I have fucking, uh, I, I grew up obese and also uh, am still overweight and also have uh, eating issues. <laughs> I would say eater. someone who's like fit and like takes care of themselves. Someone who could definitely just like throw me around. Bro, what is going on, bro? What, this is, okay, fellas, this is for us, okay? Not the 24, 23% and not the 8% non-binaries. Okay, fellas, this is just for us. Don't you sometimes get a little jealous that like ladies get so many fucking opportunities to accessorize? Maybe I'm just alone in this, but like how the, they have like toe rings, they have an ankle bracelet. What the fuck's going on? It's crazy. You can do that too. I mean, I don't know. I just like, huh. okay. The toe ring and the ankle bracelet are not great examples of accessorizing, but like, I do wish that there was a, you know, because I would not wear a fucking toe ring. And nothing is stopping me from wearing a toe ring. We get ankle braces sometimes, but they aren't the fun ones. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. She can rock an ankle bracelet, but when I do it, I can't leave, a, I can't leave my house, you know? Fucked up. Yeah. Oh, all right. That's a good turn. That's a good turn. <laughs> Noted. I have dated people of, like, all different heights and body types. So. Bittersweet? What the f***? So, 
when she's kicking someone with her with her right foot, it's bitter. But when she's kicking someone with the left foot, it's sweet. Oh, I don't I don't discriminate over here, baby. I mean, I noticed the tattoo bittersweet, and I gotta say, I really dig that. Thank you. Um, I appreciate now, it. Now, are you? lovely ladies into tattoos at all oh hell yes, yes. Oh. okay <laughs> music to my ears i have three okay i swear to god again only community where i switch off into like easy reacts from politics and i lose uh people everybody always says like react randall is the way to win an audience is the way to grab uh, you know uh develop a larger audience only community where like i move away to like actual fun variety reacts and people are like oh He's not talking exclusively about politics. I'm out. Hey, you gotta catch up, baby. I got like eight. Yeah. Oh, shit. I got six. Quite a few of us back well, here have tattoos. Well, our, I only have two. I feel on like our next, <laughs> On our next date, we could uh, go to a tattoo shop. I'm probably going to have to go based on the feet. I love the answers from this I one. Know. But I'm going to have to eliminate number one. Oh, hi. hi. Nice to meet you. Hey, nice you got a tattoo. Hi, I'm hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Yeah. I don't know. They just, they were the only ones not really done. Yeah. Like, like that, she's like, she's rocking like the Nike, you know, uh, dry fit uh, underpants and shit. Like, you think someone's just over there blasting panties? I don't think so. That would be crazy. I hike. I sure hope not. I'm like okay. lift, so yeah. nail polish just gets rubbed off. Uh, yeah, like I, like, I, I like going hiking too. Yeah. I'm, I messed up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so some are a little bit revealing, and others. I see shorts. Yeah. What are you, okay. Mormon? What the What's fuck? The shorts. Um, she said revealing. My parents are going to watch this. And <laughs> my um, parents? Yeah, this is like conservative. I love that someone's saying this is so degrading. You know, the male version of this came out last week, right? Like, we watched the male version of this, and there was not a single person that was like, this is so degrading. Obviously, there's a difference between women and men uh, in the way that we analyze women, in the way that we oppress women uh, as uh, simply objects of sexual desire. Uh, patriarchal constructs are, are very effective. I totally understand that. Totally recognize that. But sometimes it's okay. You could just like watch content like this without it immediately breaking your brain or whatever the f Yeah, it is degrading, except, you know, that's the reason why it's degenerate. It's degrading. And that's precisely why it's like kind of fun to watch. Conservative, I think for me. Whoa, conservative. Okay, okay, nice. And then number five. Oh, you, there's a lot of tattoos over there. I like yeah. that. Nice <laughs> tattoos. Yeah, I have like little kind of random bangers all over. I like love tats stick. right here, by the way. That's a fire place to have a tattoo. Respect. Folk style ones. I'm a stripper, so I'm like in my underwear for a living. So this is also very Okay, dad. Okay, all right. That's, that's cheating, okay? That's, I feel like you, that's cheating. You're literally f juicing the stats over there. You, you literally, oh, uh, it is casually dropping. Yeah, this is the guitar guy move, but for her, uh, the, for the lady. Remember how the other guy was like, remember how the other guys, it, when it was the fucking dudes, they were like, uh, one of the guys was like, yeah, my toenails are like painted because my fingernails are painted because I play the guitar and that's why they're long. Like I play the guitar, by the way. And she's like, oh, I'm a stripper. Okay. Alting. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> a stripper. What's, what's yeah. your um, favorite thing about stripping? And for the record, uh, people that say like, oh, it could go either way because it's like, you know, maybe he hates that or whatever. This is Jubilee. Okay. They probably have a check mark uh, of, uh, they have a checklist of things that they have to uh, agree to politically before they sign up for this. I doubt that there's going to be an anti-sex work uh, uh, content creator outside of like the you know incels and sex workers do they agree on things about the humanity of the sex workers themselves other than shit like that they're not going to do this yes they, they usually have like very progressive uh pro-sex work people the money uh, the money. <laughs> besides the money i went a little bit more conservative this is not the norm mm -hmm. i i just you know i think there's something to leaving a little something to the imagination right right now there was someone earlier who mentioned uh being thrown around 
Um, hi. Now, I have a personalized question for you. Oh, no. What's your biggest turn on? Um, probably, oh, no, I can't say that. Um, <laughs> I would just say, like, someone who cares about pleasing the other person more than themselves. Okay. How comfortable are you in your own body? Um, I think when I was growing up, I wasn't. Um, but then as I got older, honestly, I think that I kind of had a glow up. But yeah, I'm pretty confident, as you can kind of tell. Shout out to that. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty confident and comfortable in my body. But I think just, dude, how... I mean, you'd be bricked up in that situation. Most of you would be. Not me, of course. I'm built differently, dude. I have full command over my penis. Uh, but like, that's so, that is so embarrassing to, to be put in that situation where you're just like sitting there. That's fucking, that's, you know. It was a process. Like, I don't think it naturally came to me. I've always kind of been like the bigger, taller girl and also being like biracial and, and growing up with like a white mom. It took me a lot of time to kind of be comfortable in my skin. Back in school, I used to, to be made fun of for being like real skinny. I'm trying to learn how to love my body throughout all stages and be comfortable in it no matter what you it looks it's like. It's called a porn I'm, like, addiction? What? All the time. So so, yeah. <laughs> nice. We all have our insecurities and I definitely have some, but I go to the gym a couple times a week and I've been weight training for almost like the past year and I feel like that's helped <clears throat> with my confidence and feeling comfortable with my body a lot. There's a lot of pressure in the industry to get plastic surgery and stuff like that. And I'm very pro plastic surgery, but it is something that, you know, just being around a lot of people who have it, you think like, maybe should, do I need it? Should I get it? But I'd say for the most part, I am pretty confident in my body. <laughs> Yeah. I like that. We love a confident queen. Right. Too. <laughs> um, how confident are you in your body? Yeah. I'm definitely confident in my body. Um, oh. Yeah, I can tell. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They yeah. love that. How many am I eliminating this round? Two. Oh, Two. Oh my God. Oh. Okay. Uh, I think he's gonna eliminate these two. He's gonna eliminate two and three. Let's oh see. Gosh. Or two and five, <laughs> but. Two and three, I think. To eliminate number three. Okay. Hi, babes. Oh, oh you're oh, cute. Shoot. Thank you. Oh, wow. that's so funny. Nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. Oh, I like your tattoos. Thank too. you. Damn. We'll link up. It's cool. Uh, okay. See ya. Damn, this is hard as hell. Like I don't want to eliminate anybody. <laughs> L. Number two. Call it. Let's go. Pre-watch, baby. Pre-watch. Dude. 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 Woo! I pre-watch all my content ahead of time, baby. Let's go. I have I spend more time live during the day than not live, but it doesn't matter, dude. It doesn't matter. I'm actually it like physically is almost impossible for me to fall, also sleep and pre-watch all the content before I Yo. you know, before I actually watch it. Sometimes the video comes out, you know, while I'm live, but I'm still pre-watching. I'm Angelica. Nice to How meet. dare you say I'm bricked up? I'm using all the f juices in my brain to, to be able to do precog. Nice to meet you as well. I, I thought you were going to be taller than me, so I was like, yeah, okay, like, um, yeah. I'm tall. <laughs> It'd be tall. like that. It's okay. Yeah. No harm, no foul. Okay. It's okay. Take care. <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> let's see. What's your least favorite? Thing? Bro, he goes, okay. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, dude. God damn, so much losing in the chat right now. Might as well be called the Biden administration, am I right? Oh, baby. Thing on your body. Either my boobs or my nose. Okay. I don't think I'd ever get a boob job though. Even though like I'm kind of insecure about my boobs. I don't want to be like, yeah, I'm going to do what you want me to do. Ladies, don't do it. I mean, if it makes you feel good, sure, but don't do it. Not that it matters to me, obviously. I mean, what the fuck do I know? You know, but you don't need to, I promise. I'm gonna do the opposite instead. What does that key mean? Right. <laughs> it's the key to my heart. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> you I'm want it? To, I might have to take that right now. <laughs> I'm confident and I'm happy with the body type I have, but at the same time, if I'm feeling insecure or if I- Bro, he's picking, he's picking middle. I'm Let's be real, come like, on. body dysmorphia or anything like that, it's almost a situation where it's not accepted for me to have those insecurities or voice them because somebody might be 
a different type of body type that's more targeted in a bad way with society. So I will say like being a curvier girl, I do have like obviously like more belly and more leg than. Remember when I told you guys that like ladies always have this jewelry? Shouts out to Jin Sui for uh, getting me that. I don't even know where it is. I should, I should be rocking that more uh, frequently. Every time I've been out, every time I've been out, uh, what's the fucking, what's the, uh, <laughs> Vivian Westwood. Yeah. Every time, uh, when I used to wear pearls in the Vivian Westwood, uh, uh, necklace girls always commented on it. They always have one. Every girl has a Vivian Westwood, uh, necklace. A lot of like Instagram models and stuff do obviously like everyone has their angles and stuff that you could like kind of hide that a little bit why are you single and what do you look for in a partner I'm single because probably model. because of my bad taste in guys I've only been in one relationship technically and we never even labeled it because it was just so toxic and honestly like emotionally abusive I would say I'm single right now just because I'm a very picky person uh, I'm open to going out and casually dating and just having fun I'm not necessarily like looking for the one <laughs> Being picky, but then coming on a Jubilee fucking YouTube video where you're literally standing behind a curtain as the other dude picks you is, is a wild one. I mean, I guess like at that point, she's just like, I gave up being picky. You know what I mean? Why am I single? I'm married to uh, a, a community of 40,000 uh, psychos every day that take up 10 hours of my day and then usually even more hours of my day after that when i'm pre-watching all the videos obviously to come across super smart uh so you know that's don't have a lot of time for uh like personal anything. life i actually moved out here from the east coast with my ex at the time so put on my best clown makeup and came out here and oh. <laughs> it did not work out it did not work out i'm looking for someone that's wholesome He's picking, he's picking middle. Okay. He's going middle. He's going middle. So the person I'm going to have to eliminate, unfortunately, is number three. He's picking middle. He's picking Hi. middle. Hi. Damn, I love your hair. That's <laughs> Thank sick. you. Oh, Hi. Hi. Hi, Emily. I'm Makai. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, What's like up? Your tattoos. Thank you. I like your tattoos. You have a nice, nice story. Yeah. You do have nice. He has really has nice eyes, by the way. He really Thank does. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. <laughs> I like the hearts. Hair is cool. <laughs> <laughs> dope. I'm going to have to eliminate number two. One year of brain. What? Life, yay. Thanks. Hi. No, I was wrong. Hi. Hi. I'm Christina. Oh, Foolish. Hi, nice to meet Foolish. you. Foolish. Nice to meet you. Damn. Foolish. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, you just seem very, very shy. I like your answers. Though, yeah. But, yeah. I got like the same glasses as you. You do? What's your vision? Are you uh, uh -oh. sighted? So, oh my God, she's still flirting with him after she got, she got clapped and she's still flirting. She's like, oh, what are your glasses? Near side. Foolish. Where you can see what a fucking L. Hold the L. I mean, the first girl's also probably very cute as well, but like. Right. Right. Yeah. Give me, yeah. Give me, give me, give me. You want to take my glasses? Okay, yeah. for sure. Can I see them with the. Oh, yours is, oh, I don't know. Like, uh, I got fucked up last night. <laughs> like, it's like it's, 3D, huh? It's like a little strong. Big L, big L, hold it, hold it. You're holding it, you're holding it. You're holding the L. Yeah. Oh, I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> don't be sorry, you good. It was nice meeting you. Thank I'm you. Sorry. <laughs> Come on up. Never mind, Hi. big dub. Hello, I'm Makai. That's right. Can I hug you? Yeah, of course. I've been hugging everyone. Hello. Hi. Hi. Maddie. Um, you have nice tattoos, and I like your answers as well, especially with the key to the heart thing. That one, yeah. that one was dope. That one was dope. It's, a, it's okay. It's a dub. See, like, it's a dub. Good, good for him. What happened? Still L, I'm but you know. Right now. <laughs> I don't know where. <laughs> Can I have your number, Instagram? Y'all actually do make like a really I cute like couple. It. So like, yeah. um, if y'all don't date, I don't see that. Like, yeah. 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 Someone as soon as he seen the panties, that's all she wrote. I mean, yeah, that that was a big advantage, I think. Like, if you're rocking, if you're rocking, actually, like, you know, like, if you're rocking panties when everybody else is it's like bringing a fucking, you know, is bringing a gun to a knife fight, you know. <laughs> I don't want to be horny anymore. I just want to be happy. Oh, it's true. I do feel that way. Hey, if you like this video, please subscribe.
and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. <laughs>